Hi, I'm Danny White, and I just want to tell you a little something to all you Taylor Swift haters out there. You know what I mean? Well, you know, what do you have on Taylor Swift? What makes you hate her so much? I mean, what has she done to you? Really? I mean, has Taylor Swift, like, personally come into your home and said, I hate you? You know, or has she personally said anything to you to make you hate her? I mean, what is it? Is it that she's famous? Is it that she's pretty? Is it that she can write songs? Is it that she can play guitar? What is it that makes Taylor Swift so prone to gossip and rumors? Horrible, nasty rumors. And Joe Jonas. What is up with Joe Jonas? I mean, for all you Taylor Swift lovers out there, you know, all the people who are on Taylor's side when... Joe Jonas broke up with her? I mean, you understand what I mean, right? What the heck is wrong with him? 27 seconds. I mean, at least he could have gone into more detail. I mean, that phone call must have been like... It must have gone something like this. Hey, Taylor. Um, I don't love you anymore, so I'm, we're not going to go out anymore. Bye. Or something like that. I mean, seriously. Who does that? What kind of man does that? I'll tell you what kind of man. Not even a man. A little boy. A little cowardly boy. That's exactly what you are, Joe Jonas. You're a little baby. Who doesn't know what he wants, okay? I mean, I don't care what you think about this video. I really don't. I don't even care if you see it or not. I hope you do, so you'll learn a lesson. But... <sighs> Taylor Swift... Is the, it seems like the sweetest person ever. Okay? And I bet you did cheat on her. I bet you did cheat on her. And I hate you for that. I hate you, Joe Jonas. You're an idiot. You're a jerk and you're an idiot. I've always thought you were an idiot, but... A jerk? I mean, really. Why did you have to prove me right? Especially with Taylor Swift. I mean, she's my hero. I mean, Taylor Swift is so sweet and down to earth. Unlike you, with your big head in the clouds. Thinking you're the biggest thing that's ever happened into the world. You're the, you're the worst thing that's ever happened to the world, Joe Jonas. Now, I'm not saying the other Jonas Brothers suck. I'm just saying you do. I've got nothing against the others. It's just you. And, you know... Your little brother looks up to you. You know what I mean? So, I mean, why show him that kind of example? I mean, even though he's 16, 17 years old, still, he will look up to you. So he's going to do the exact same thing that you've done. Okay? You understand that? You've created another monster, Joe Jonas. Which makes me wonder, where did he get it from? Did he get it from his dad? Did he get it from... Another male relative? Did he get from his older brother, though? I mean, you don't really hear about Kevin Jonas. I mean, what's up with that? Really? But anyways, Taylor Swift, you don't deserve this. I mean, really. To still be pretty, to still be a good sport about it, I salute you, because I would have kicked his butt. I mean, I literally would have made him black and blue. If it would have been me he broke up with. I've had plenty of guys say some rude things. I've had plenty of people, just in general, say rude things to me. And, but the difference is that you're famous and I'm not, you know? So it's a bigger deal for you. I mean, and then the rumor about you being pregnant? Seriously. I mean, what would make someone think that about you? I mean, you're so sweet and nice. I mean, what kind of idiot would say that? I'll tell you what kind of idiot Joe Jonas. I bet Joe Jonas started that rumor. I don't really know who started the rumor, but you're an idiot and you're a jerk like Joe Jonas. And I don't like you either. I hate you, you Taylor Swift haters. And to all you Joe Jonas lovers and Taylor Swift haters, you know what? You can just eat your words, okay? Because I don't like you either. You're just as bad as him. You're just as stupid and jerky as him. 
And I don't like those kind of people. I mean, my friends definitely sided with Taylor Swift in that argument. Which shouldn't have even happened because, you know, really, Joe Jonas, one day, you're going to feel the pain that Taylor Swift felt. And I hope it hurts. Really bad. And Taylor, I hope you can get over what he's done to you. And I hope you can live past it to be a better person than him. I really do. Because he's not worth it. He really isn't. But, you know, it's cool that you can be really awesome and cool about it. Because, I mean, it's really hard, I guess, you know, to be a celebrity and then have a major breakup. You know, being a teenager is not easy, but being a teenager in the spotlight must be, like, five times worse. Because not only is it a popularity contest, it's a battle of the wills contest. Who can make it without going crazy and start smoking pot and drinking beer and, you know, constantly out all night partying? I mean, it must be really hard. I mean, it's hard for regular teenagers not to do that. And I've kept myself away from it. I've never drank. I've never done cigarettes. I've never done pot of any kind. And I'm still a virgin. You know? So I'm just like... Why would people say things like this? I mean, it's retarded. It's absolutely retarded. Okay? And that's just all I've got to say about this. Before I, like, punch somebody in the face. I mean, Taylor Swift, I salute you. And this has been Danny White.